Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to the final episode of Spy Classrooms. So let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. Okay, let me say it like this. Technically, their mission ended last week. So, I just feel like this might be a filler episode or just like a, well, a catch up from how they were at the beginning half of the series versus now. Just like a look back and then maybe like something on to the future. I have no freaking clue. Yay! <laughs> Bring <Brilliant. laughs> Yeah. Oh. So upset. Oh. <laughs> yeah.
It's not what you think, Lily. Oh, so you think because he... <laughs> oh, man, I mean, and I get it, because yes, look at him. Look at him. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Now they're all gonna think. <laughs> <laughs> right? I mean, damn. You might as well. You'll never have this chance again. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. They're all going to have some weird way of confessing to him. Oh my god. Oh, no. Got a lot on my mind right now. <laughs> Lily. <laughs> oh god <laughs> oh no <laughs> right and and an adult
<laughs> the fact that Monica just up and left. <laughs> oh my god. Isn't that... There's literally nothing else I could do. Oh. I feel like that's not more of enough information though. Mm. Damn, that's fucked up.
Oh my god. <laughs> hey, let, let's just go ahead and see what the fuck happened. Oh. <laughs> mhm. Mm <laughs> so yeah, no. Klaus is not in love with any of you. <laughs> Lily. Okay, so final thoughts on this show overall. This was good. It was very much different than most spy type series. Um, I think, you know, th this is a filler episode. In my opinion, it was, but still mainly a part of the main story. But it was still good. I, I love the fact that once again, we got to see episodes focused on all of them. But I hate the fact that this is the last episode because I really was expecting more. I really don't think they're going to continue it. I mean, 12 episodes or really 24 episodes altogether is enough for it. It does make me want to read either, I think, the manga or the light novel of this series to see where these girls are going to possibly head up. Well, head up. Mm -mm, I can't speak. La 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 la. <laughs> Whatever they're going to be getting into in the next arc because there's got to be another arc after this like th there's no way in hell they would end it like this and then 
that be it, you know? But it was good. I, I like the fact that it ended on, like, a happy you note know, for it. And especially in a funny, silly way where, yes, <laughs> four girls all thought that Klaus was in love with them. But we knew, especially when Greta tried confessing, that he he's incapable of being in love with someone. But he can, quote-unquote, love someone Kind of, but not really. It's complicated. Well, damn! Yeah, this was truly fucking underrated. I mean, really, it was good. I do feel like, I mean, yeah, we could have a season three um, if they really wanted to. But I feel like, in a way, it's wrapped up everything of part one of the important arc. And so going into more things about what Serpent is going to do. But it, it was really good. It was different. I mean, it's just because of the success of Spy Family, um... I do love the fact that we're getting a lot more Spy S series or how, like, I like to say, and I cannot believe I'm going to compare this, um, because the, the other show that I'm watching, I think either tomorrow or Monday, um, y'all remember the one show that COVID kind of killed? I, and I, I did a reaction of it. Um, The Millionaire Detective, how that guy could, like, big hella popular but of course way years before that was Detective Conan because Detective Conan is still big even as of now we're getting so many other versions of quote-unquote detectives and I have nothing wrong I'm like I, I still love that because I'm a girl who loves me some mystery and such and it, it's good and I love the success of how popular Spy Family was to have all these other spy ass animes um, or get, series get greenlit into an anime adaptation. I think this was really good with the ensemble cast of these female characters and such and their um, saves. I think everybody did a good job. I think if the show would possibly continue on, um, some characters who probably didn't get the most development would most definitely get something in another season and such. So yeah, maybe not now, but like maybe in a good couple of years, I definitely could see a potential season three coming out with this. But yeah, this was truly underrated and, but so good as fuck. A lot of, un a lot of my questions got answered, but still at the same time, you're left with a, a lot of unanswered questions. Uh, but I would definitely watch it again, like in a heartbeat. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards the entirety 
of season two of Spy Family, of <laughs> Spy Family, of Spy Classroom. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all um, next week for the continuation of fall anime. Tomorrow for more stuff and then anything else in between. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.